What is going on, YouTube? Today, we got the rocket spray painted and all finished, but it's not all finished because we have to do probably the hardest part yet the decals. This is actually my first time doing these water decals. Um, and I got all the supplies here. We have, give me a second, let me just balance the rocket so it doesn't fall. Okay, that's good. Okay, so we got the paper towels, we got some q tips. We got the decals, scissors, and water. So I'm gonna get everything set up here. And let's continue the model rocket build. Okay, I probably haven't mentioned this already, but this is my first time doing these um, water slide off decals. It was really hard for me because being the picky self that I am, these decals rip like a lot. And um, it took me like 20 minutes to just finish my first decal, and after that I kind of got um, like more lenient on how good it was because I knew that if I worked too long in it, it probably would have break, broke, 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 yeah. And um, I watched a video on how to do these decals, and I used um, wet and dry Q-tips and had a bowl of water so I could... Um, take the decal off of the sh paper sheet it w the sheet it was on and I think right now right here the sticker actually rips in half and that was actually kind of annoying because what happens is when it rips in half I have to try to realign it again but then since the um since the decal also has some on the side it also is really hard to align it there so overall these this was actually probably the hardest part in this entire model rocket build because this was not only was this my first time but it was also um, broke a lot and I had to like fix it and it took me a really long time to do that so after like after the first set of wings there I got the I started to get better at doing it and when I did those, um, the, like the, those things at top, on top, you can see it breaks a lot of times. And what's happening is that when I try to fix one side, the other side breaks because I'm holding the other side with that. So that was actually kind of annoying. But at the same time, I had to align it too. So, and it was three, I had to do that three times. And... There was extra extra decals. I'm, I'm not sure what they were for, but I just didn't use them. And right now, I'm putting on... Uh, you can't really see it, but I'm putting on the decals that say ESAM58 with the two red lines. And yeah, you can see it now, but before you could. So, um, this one, I kind of got... I kind of got... Uh, I don't know what that word is, but what happened is that I, I got impatient because in, I because for the other ones I used like a Q-tip to um, to spread it out and let it dry, but instead of letting it dry, I just moved on to the next side. But then when I was holding the next side, the other side moved, and then I had to like keep doing it over and over again. So that was um, very stressful, and that's probably took up a lot of time too. Yeah, and the and you can see like the my the bowl there that has all the water is kind of I don't know what happened to it, but it broke, so now water's leaking out too. And that and then like and then the water leaked out onto the spread sheet of decals, so I had to Get, quickly get a paper towel, dry it, and then cut it up so so that it wouldn't cut, slide off. But overall, this um, rocket build so. for the decals really helped me. So, here's Finished. the final result. The rocket. Just need to wait for the decals to dry. Yes, this was my first time actually doing decals, so very tricky stuff. Very tricky. Now, We'll need a round, launch it, and see if it goes 800 feet up. It's time for this. 